Let me ask a question. Only one question. What is TikTok? Wait. Let me rephrase.、Um, what is TikTok to the U.S.? Oh、uh, no no no. What is TikTok to a U.S. resident? Uh, not a president with balloon phobia and TikTok phobia. I mean,、uh, a common person, people who don't have a yard sitting in their private dock. Very quickly, yes or no? It's okay. I totally understand why you're so suspicious about TikTok. I know because you love it. We all love it. You say you are concerned about the harmful content inflicting emotional distress on young users. How? By letting them start their own business on TikTok and gathering followers from all over the world, so that they can make their lives better. Many of them only use it for entertainment.、Um, but what about YouTube, Facebook, Instagram? We should appreciate this great invention of our humanity, shouldn't we? Okay, again, you said, and you expect us to believe that you are capable of maintaining the data. Who does? Come on, it's 2023. Same answer. How about YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, Quora? If you really care about your users' privacy security, just encourage developments in data security, please. Yes. To be yes, most. Yes. Yes. Maybe that will also help the jobless in your country. You're welcome. You know, I'm quite optimistic that TikTok will not be banned in the U.S.、Um, because in a country of freedom, the government will listen to their people's voice. That's what I learned from American social media, anyways. How much you hate it? How much you need it? Final point. I come from a country that not only doesn't care about the world's poor, it doesn't even care about its own poor.